So these small fish, three spines stickleback, have been the focus of studies for 100 years. And people have known that when you look at their external traits, size, shape, body color, they can evolve independently in freshwater after glaciers receded in most regions of the Northern Hemisphere about 12 to 15,000 years ago. So we wonder, well, could this actually happen a lot faster? We identified a set of islands in the Gulf of Alaska that were uplifted during a very major earthquake. It was actually the second largest earthquake ever recorded. Within a few minutes, some of these islands were uplifted four or five meters. So it wasn't a small change, it was a pretty significant change. And so we were able to peg the formation of these small ponds that we now found stickleback in. And the study that we're publishing, we found that the traits actually evolved to the same extent as those other populations we'd studied, but the same level of divergence has happened in 50 years. So the evolution has happened very quickly. And so the significance for this is we've now moved the time scale of the evolution of the stickleback fish to decades so this is a big finding for the field, and this may be more of a common uh, trend over other organisms as well too, so I suspect that other people are gonna ask questions about rapid genomic evolution on these timescales.